thought it did pretty well. I mean, we started out very fast, and as we got to the end, we started moving pretty slow. I think we need to pick up on that and just work on it when we get back from spring break. What was the tempo of something that the coaches talked about afterwards? Uh, yes, sir. I mean, definitely, you know, that's that's our main thing. We're, we're trying to go fast all the time, and at the end, I mean, like I said, at the beginning, we were going really fast, and we were doing really good, and then at the end, we started, you know, uh, tempering down, and that, that's not what we want to do. We want to move fast at all times. With all you guys kind of splitting some first-team reps, just – is there any pressure to, to maybe press with some of those reps, knowing that you're only going to get so many? I mean, we're just going out and being who we are, playing quarterback, just trying to get better every day. That's what we're all focused on, helping each other and just trying to get better as a unit. How did you feel like Jalen Hurd did today? It seems like he was able to get out in the open and make some plays. Yeah, I feel like he did very good, you know, just getting out in the open, making people miss. That's what he does. He's a big body. He can run fast. So that's what we need. Do you expect someone that that's big is that they can do some of those moves like he did out there? Do you expect them just to run, run try and run people over? I, I, I knew he could do that all along. I mean, I was just waiting for, waiting for it to happen. And today it seemed like he broke out. I mean, he was comfortable. He, he's getting to know his plays now, so he's getting very comfortable in the offense. It, it seemed like towards the end of the scrimmage, the defensive line started getting you guys more and more. Did, could you guys? start to really feel that pressure yeah we could feel that pressure I mean the defensive line they they get I coached one over there and talked to them and told them they need to they need to get a lot physical and uh that's what they did so I mean we definitely felt the pressure Riley you had that uh, touchdown throw to Marquez North in the back corner take us through what that was and, and if you if that was any impromptu by work by you um it was just uh all go play and I knew Marquez was one-on-one -on -one and You've seen all the catches he's made at practice and things like that, so I have no other choice pretty much but to go to him. So I have a lot of confidence in throwing it up to him, and he went up and grabbed it for me. It seemed like all you guys changed the unit. Some, each of you worked with the ones, each of you worked with the twos. Is that, is that accurate? Yes, yeah, so that's accurate. Uh, we just rotated in. We're all getting a you know, fair share, getting a shot, and then we're all just you know trying to get better every day and show what we can do. What do you feel most proud of what you've done out here on the field, being out here practicing with these guys so far here in year two? Um, I would say just commanding the offense. I'm trying to you know, have, have a louder voice in the field and just trying to command everybody and get them to just follow me and just lead the offense, whether it's the line, getting everybody lined up, or it's the receivers and telling them where to go and telling them what play we're running. Have you had to direct them and kind of line guys up? Uh, it's still, there's still a little bit of lining up confusion at this point with the receivers. Um, it's not. It hasn't really been a problem. I mean, when we get fatigued, it, that's that's when you know people they don't they don't like to think when they get fatigued. So I mean, that's that's the main thing we need to work on, and that's all we're trying to do in the offseason, just trying to get everybody to learn the playbook and just move fast.